All right, fam, Mr. Beast just uploaded. I know it's been like 24 hours since I posted, guys. I am... Um, I had a bad experience this Friday, and I will, uh... I will, uh, you know, upload a video talking about it more, but for now we're gonna react to one versus $2,500 bit, 25000 or $50,000 vacation from Mr. Beast. Let's check it out. In this video, we're going on a $250,000 vacation. Dude, look at that, though. It looks so legit. Is that Jimmy right there? I think that's Jimmy. <laughs> Guys, I'd be scared right there. What the heck? Guys, what is this? This is beautiful. How is this real? It's trippy. Wait, what the heck? Okay, that's scary, man. I'm scared of what uh, roller coasters. Yo, is that PewDiePie? That's PewDiePie. <laughs> Yo. I'm show you the difference between this and a one hundred thousand dollar presidential vacation. Right this way, sir. A fifty thousand dollar vacation where we have the Eiffel Tower completely to ourselves. I'm holding on for dear life. All the way down to this one dollar vacation. Right over here, boys. This shack is our vacation. You can see inside of it. There's no walls, Jimmy. Well, I mean, there's walls. This is gross. And in case you don't believe me, it's a dollar. Look at that. Oh, it's 93 cents. You're a liar. I rounded up to a dollar. Oh my gosh, bro. How do you find, what app is, anyone know what app he's using for this? He said a dollar, guys. Oh my gosh. For one dollar, we get this bed, which is honestly just a mattress sitting on wood planks, a broken cabinet, a light that sort of works. Oh, look at that. And lastly, random noises coming from your ceiling. I was hearing noise in the room, and there's a raccoon on our roof. I feel like most, oh. most people would be mad if their hotel room had a raccoon, but for some reason, we're happy. Oh. When's checkout time? Yo, it's, it's actually friendly. <laughs> Tomorrow. Uh, Keep in mind that later in this video, we're going on a hundred thousand dollar vacation, a two hundred fifty thousand dollar vacation. Can we just jump cut to that already? No, because we gotta suffer so they can compare our suffering to our happiness. They do like when we suffer. Are we all supposed to fit on this single bed? If we wanted four beds, that'd be four dollars. First, let's get all the sand. Wait. <laughs> the raccoon just ran in here. I'm gonna act like I didn't scream. Oh, yo, what the guys? Why do, why do animals keep visiting them, man? <laughs> and we'll just straight up visit. Like a, a little girl. <laughs> up next, a vacation that's 10,000 times more expensive. Welcome to the $10,000 a night vacation. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Yo, this is sick. Wait, what the heck is this? <laughs> this hotel room has jellyfish. Okay, that's so... Bro, did they not even spend a night there? Wow, that's cool though. <laughs> Somebody said that's unnecessary. I think it is totally necessary. And, and and justified they bring uh jellyfish like come on it's ten thousand dollars guys so unnecessary oh there's a pool outside it's a private pool does this not look like a scene from a movie your hotel room walks out to the beach wow is this our own private beach oh my gosh this is incredible drink since when is water this blue i don't know this all-inclusive vacation also has a giant spa oh yeah. Yeah! A park filled with flamingos. Guys, you know, you know spas are the best. Oh snap, they got flamingos. Can we pet them? That would be, be awesome if we could pet those flamingos. Oh, they're fighting. Wow. Flamingos. And unlimited room service. Okay, what do you need? All of it. <laughs> the only <laughs> negative of this place is it doesn't have a raccoon. Hey, little guy. But I don't blame Damn, bro. He seems quite angry, bro. I guess he was hungry. Blame them for that. When you spend ten thousand dollars at this resort, we each get our own floor of the building. Yeah, bro. They, they didn't go from a hundred dollars. They went straight to ten thousand dollars, guys. Woo! That's quite a bit, right, guys? Looks exactly like Jimmy's, except for I got the. T Chris looking good, man. I, I, I do. You know, Chris has been on hormones for like six months, and we we like the progress Chris is going through, man. I gotta, like, uh, you know, go to the doctor and get back on hormones, because I'm running out. Top floor. Oh, I have a hammock. I think I can make it in the hammock without getting wet. <laughs> I did it. Yo, look at your view. Chris! Hey! Ow! I Yo, what the heck? Guys, Chris rec uh, recently changed his her name from uh, Chris with the C to Chris with the K, and now she goes by... Uh, see her pronouns, guys. So is, is it gonna be like a you know Chris Jenner? I don't know. 
I, I never met like a you know never met a somebody that was a fi assigned female at birth that, that had the name Chris with a K. But hey, that's cool. I I I'm all uh, I all support that. I caught it. Three, two, one. Hey. All right, oh. let me lay out some rules. Rule number one. Yeah. No more throwing pillows in my pool. He said my pool. Uh, rule number two. <laughs> Sorry, Tariq. And now what the hotel is known for. This insane infinity pool that extends over our own personal beach. How does the water just not overflow? I have so many questions. I feel like a father that took his kids on vacation and is just watching them hang out in the pool. Ah! Yo, that's so cool. I'd be scared bringing my electronics there, though, guys. You know what I mean? Ah, ah! The ten thousand dollar vacation has been insane, but not as insane. Didn't see what food they got. <laughs> hey, cool, cool. Uh, next vacation, cool all vacation. the way across the planet. And now the fifty thousand dollar vacation in Paris. Watch, oh, it's gonna come with like a personal yacht and stuff, man. <laughs> Baguettes. Our $50,000 vacation starts with a completely private luxury ferry ride. What oh, is that? Snap. What's the engine? Bro, what is this, 1805? <laughs> Guys, how is it running on that, man? They got some motors under there, right? Tariq, Tariq, zoom in on that guy. He's filming us. Hey! <laughs> they went back. Do you have a YouTube channel? <laughs> I, I don't think he speaks English. This vacation... <laughs> and that's why I'm scared of going to... A any any country other than the USA that doesn't speak English and said like we can go to um I can go to Japan and the UK. That's about it though. It comes complete with fantastic food. Oh snap. A tour of the entire Frog legs, guys. Ugh. City. Alright. And a luxury hotel room with an amazing view. This is kinda of romantic, huh? Yeah. You and Chandler should kiss. And last <laughs> he's like, no man. Yo, they got like Expensive water and stuff. We have a very expensive surprise. So you guys are probably wondering. It's a fifty thousand dollar. They're drinking monsters. <laughs> they, they, they just asked for a monster energy drink on that fifty thousand vacation. No expensive wine or anything, and that's fine because you know alcohol does. You know, I don't think they want to drink alcohol in this video, right, guys? It's for like you know age restrictions. Our vacation, and we clearly haven't spent fifty grand yet. No. Yeah, where where is it? It's behind you. What do you That's mean? the Eiffel Tower. Yes. We have the entire Eiffel Tower completely to ourselves. Wait, actually? Yeah. What portion of the 50 grand was the tower? Almost all of it. <laughs> <laughs> we are at the Eiffel Tower. Dang, bro. They sent, spent 43K just to reserve the Eiffel Tower, man. Would you guys do that? Tower. This feels like we're sneaking in. No, I'm not joking. It's ours. No one else is here. We can just go straight through the line. This Ooh. feels illegal. Most of the time, this place is packed with people. And because we have the whole thing completely to ourselves, we're gonna try to get to the top of the tower. I'm talking the very top. Boys, enough playing around. Let's head up. On the way up, we stopped at the first floor, over 187 feet in the air, where we had a world-class restaurant all to ourselves. I love how even though we have the entire ice Dang, bro. <laughs> they beat out every single other per like tourist and everything. Guys. <laughs> so if you were visiting Paris right then and there, you you'd be screwed. You know what I mean? You wouldn't have nothing. You you'd you would not be able to take pictures for social media. You'd be uh down bad. Cause Mr. Beast is there. Full tower. They still put us in a corner of the restaurant. <laughs> Hey, that, that, they can do that for privacy, like, you know what I mean? I like having the corner. That's the elevator coming from the top of the Eiffel Tower. That looks terrifying. Open sesame. Thank you. I can see my house from up here. We're in France. <laughs> I can see my hotel from up here. Look how high up we are. Oh, my ears are popping. What? I did not know they even manufactured this, guys. I just thought it was like an old rusty tower, but they got like a restaurant and everything. Good business move, right, guys? What are we working with here? Oh my god, you can see the whole city this from here. Dude, this is crazy. Tree, look how much higher we have to go. Bro, this is never gonna end. I'm not gonna lie, I thought we were already at the top. <laughs> we're going up. Now we're heading to the top. At one point, this was the tallest building in the world. Should I jump right now? No, do not move. Come on, boys, follow me. From yeah, don't, don't be making that, those kind of jokes. You know what I mean? You can get, you can get hit with a yellow dollar sign for making those kind of jokes on the video. Here on out, there's no more elevators, just stairs. Oh, it's windy up here. We are high up there. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. 
god. Oh, Drake, don't drop the camera. Whoa. We are standing over 900 feet in the air. That's pretty high up there, man. The in. highest point civilians are allowed on the tower. But since it's ours for the night, I had one last surprise. What do you think's behind this door? Stairs! How'd you, did I, how'd you know? We can see the stairs. Well, yes, there are more stairs, but this takes us to the very top where no one's allowed to go. My god. Oh my gosh. Yo. Bro. Oh my god. Are we allowed on that? I don't know. Oh, that is scary. The ledge just comes up to my waist up here. I'm holding on for dear life. I can. That's scary, man. They should add more uh, stuff to make it, uh, uh, you know, <laughs> safe for them, bro. Like, they. When somebody, if somebody falls off the rails right there, they're screwed. Completely understand why tourists are not allowed up here. We have a cameraman on the other side of the city with a lens zoomed in on us. He's over a mile away. If this lens is good enough, you should be able to see us waving for a $50,000. Hey, it's not the best quality, but it did work. It did work, guys. Vacation, you gotta admit, this is cool. This is amazing. It's a once in a lifetime it's experience. Cool. Are you ready for the best moment yet? I don't know why a YouTuber has this much power, but lights! Oh, there we go! Oh, snap. Okay, not the best show with lights, but hey, you know, it's like my computer. <laughs> it's like somebody's keyboard. Holy cow! They can do better than that. They can do better than that, right, guys? Guys, I don't know if this next command's gonna work, but turn every light off. Snap. Okay, now that's. It's Beach Point. The Eiffel Tower went dark. What are these millions of French people thinking right now? Code blue, code blue. <laughs> they should get me off this tower. I don't know why they gave me this much control. Next, we head to Switzerland for the $100,000 vacation. But this is no ordinary vacation. Switzerland, man, they gotta go across the country. This hotel has two inch thick bulletproof windows, a panic button that will lock down the entire building and is riddled with security because this is a hotel where world leaders and presidents take their vacation. And also the side men were in town, so I decided to invite them as well. Oh, oh my God. It smells like food in here. We've got the whole ocean in there. Yo, side men. It's KSI's group. Let's go, let's go. Uh, not fan of seafood though. What? This is nuts. This is the most expensive. Don't know much, much about the Sidemen either, guys. I don't watch their videos. Expensive penthouse suite in all of Europe. It covers the whole eighth floor and has dozens of rooms. I don't call it a penthouse. <laughs> Tons of staff waiting on you all day and night, and absolutely crazy food everywhere. Want a hit? Yeah, get a hit. Oh my that. gosh, is that a giant? Like, oh yeah. How do these guys compare to your uh, normal guests? Yeah. <laughs> so you'd say they're pretty dumb compared to. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, yeah, man, I see this all the time, bro. I'm a owner. I'm the freaking manager for a hundred thousand dollar resort. Wonder how often they get business. And like I said before, some of the most powerful world leaders choose this place for their vacations. Even Bill Clinton stayed here, and he wasn't assassinated. It's pretty safe. In terms of security <laughs> here, you have the bulletproof. Yeah, with how fam famous a uh, beast is getting, he might already have security. Uh, uh, this uh, this tough, you know what I mean? Windows. In the USA, we got something like this as well, but. I'm not sure if uh, he's gonna go to one like that. Even this? This is foolproof? I wonder if any of them are gonna be in the USA, guys, besides the first one. Oh my, it feels- And second one. Uh, I'm not sure if the second one is in there, but- Thick! Oh, really solid. Yeah, I hope. I'm yeah. a president. Yeah, also some snipers that we can put on the rooftop. You have your own sniper? <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Are you able to negotiate on behalf of the Sidemen? I can try my best. Yes, uh, this will help me in my negotiation. I'd like to buy 10%. How much, boys? No, oh, you, the guy, you say. Bro, bro, what is this, Shark Tank? Come on now. <laughs> you said you want to buy 10% of the side. 200 million. Where's KSI, bro? KSI's in the side, man, right, guys? Million, Jimmy. 200 million. Jeez, bro, okay. All right, to the panic button. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, I've been waiting to press this button since we got here. We all agree this is a good idea. No, no, no. no. <laughs> Carl, you're Bill Clinton and you feel threatened. Press the panic button. All right, he pressed it. Oh, wait, I see a door closed. Wait, are we locked in? Is it locked? Are you guys in there? Is that Nolan? Yeah. The door's like shut. I walked off for one second. Which button? No. Hey, bro, you got locked out, bro. Where's Chris? Man. Chris doesn't. Uh, opens it. You don't get to- I just want to have Chris in this one, man. Panic and then open it. <laughs> I guess he's busy. <laughs> they should be 
She's busy, sorry. Push the button now, the priest will come, and there's a big fine. Don't press it again. <laughs> <laughs> I've been thinking, how would a president get somewhere like McDonald's? Let's see how presidents travel. Come on in. It turns out when you're the president, you have to go everywhere with your bodyguards, so that means when you drive... Oh, we got like a oh, motorcade, okay. <laughs> How do we know which car to get into? On the third, on the fourth. Ideally the third or fourth, you said? Which car is the most dangerous? The first one. Nolan, you should ride in the first one. I can do that. Okay. <laughs> Who wants to ride with me? Harry, come on in. You know, don't know which is which, guys. That's how they did. That's how they do it, though. Harry Chandler. I'm sure the president doesn't sit in the middle. Typically, he goes. Man, that'd be the one of the scariest things when that happens, though. When they gotta go from their car to the the place. To be my bodyguards, but you know, you'll suffice. Just squeeze in, mate. Squeeze in. <laughs> <laughs> the president is going to McDonald's. Does your window roll down? Hey, how's it going? No, now I'm gonna get shot. Oh, now I'm gonna no. get shot. Oh, I can't believe we can do this. This is nice. Turns out when you travel in a presidential motorcade, a lot of people start to notice you. How's it going? <laughs> this is bonkers, man. Oh, Same, bro. Paparazzi. I mean, it's Mr. Beast, the number one most followed uh, channel in the. Our remote subscribe channel on the planet right now, man. Almost, almost a planet. Just drawing the attention of everyone. People are filming like with the president. This is weird. Which made McDonald's uh, a little awkward. <laughs> Don't mind our security. Jimmy, does this beat out the Eiffel Tower for you? Depends how good these nuggets are. Obviously, all the vacations so far have been amazing, but they. <laughs> I'd be scared going in there. I'd be like, yo, why are there so many security guards, bro? I'm starting to get paranoid. <laughs> Guys, would you get get paranoid in this situation? I for sure would. Let me know in the comments below. Pale in comparison to this next one. Our final vacation is once again all the way across the planet. Uh, as we thought it would. Oh, is this Japan? And, and now we're... Oh, snap. Japan coming in? Let's go. Let's go. In Japan for the $250,000 vacation. And we're meeting up with a special guest here. This is the final thing, bro. We didn't go to 500,000. We, we didn't go to a million. Oh, who's the special yes, guest? You're going to want to watch to the end. To start off our vacation, yeah. we is it going to be I Show Speed? Is it going to be Kai Sanat? Who knows, man? Dropped off our bags at the most. He's a special vet guest. Expensive hotel in all of Japan. This is gigantic. I have an echo in a hotel room. And afterwards, we felt like getting to know the city of Tokyo. Now we're going to drive Mario Karts on the street. <laughs> <laughs> we rented private Mario Karts where we literally get to drive on the streets of Japan. People are just staring at us. This is not meant to be. They're like freaking tourists, man. What are they doing with them Mario Karts? Japan doesn't have that. Uh, that, that they got like lower. Um, build quality like like no they don't have a freaking super trucks everywhere like usa man they just got like little minivans little little minivans bro that they're like class c vehicles man on a street there's real cars driving right beside me well look how many people are they're just like a little bit smaller that uh on average than uh, crossing the street man ima imagine bro, bro look at those cars just caught up in the middle of the street right there man here. This is the busiest crosswalk in the world, and we're driving right through it. <laughs> <laughs> we're on go karts in Tokyo! Going fast! Bro, I love Japan. This place is crazy. When we arrived at our next destination, we met with Master Swordman Yoshioki Somita. He's been training with the katana for the last 26 years, and he actually agreed to give us a rare lesson in the art of the samurai. Is that the special guest? It might be, it might be. We each got our own katanas, and the lessons began with swinging techniques. Well, it was not as easy as we thought. So, there's Chris, yay! No! Oh, no, man. they're gonna zoom in on it. Then it was my turn. Boys, you think I'm gonna be able to do this? Yes. Yeah, you got it. Oh, not bad, not bad. Mr. B's got it. Hey! Let's see how the boys do. Whoa! Who am I? And then, our samurai teacher gifted us this insane katana. I don't deserve yeah. this, oh. but thank you. And because this is a quarter... Yeah, now you can defend your house with that, bro. <laughs> That's a cool katana. ...million dollar vacation, we rented out the most... I'm sure they have security for this. I'm sure they do, but, like, you know, they're not gonna, like, show them. You know, security for whatever. ...premium sushi chef in the world. Along with What's this net? entire floating restaurant. They got Louis Vuitton what the heck? The chef makes... Is that an ice block? It looked like an ice block. All the food right next to our table. And getting <laughs> to see a master at work was one of the... Well, that looks like chocolate syrup, but it's probably like soy sauce or something. 
<laughs> Coolest dining experiences ever. Hey, I'm not a fan of sushi though, guys, are you? Oh my god. Oh. They said we could feed the birds tuna. Here you go, little man. What? See how we can- Oh, Snappy caught it. What? That's pretty awesome, yo. I, I bet the- I bet the boat driver feeds them occasionally. Caught him in air. And once we paid the bill- Thank you. <laughs> we were off to the craziest place I've ever been. Alright, follow me. I rented this whole place. But before we see it- Socks off. This is basically- oh, I'm gonna be in Japan. An art museum, but for experience. Whoa. Whoa. I, I thought that was a water slide, yo. <laughs> I didn't know they had water parks in Japan, but apparently, probably not, maybe. I don't know. Oh my god. What the? I have goosebumps. My eyes are having a hard time processing Dude. it. Do you think this is what it looks like when you die? Probably. What is this oh next row? <gasps> Normally, this place is completely full of other people, but we secured the place entirely for ourselves. This might be one of the best things we've ever done. Dude. Bro, this is so high tech. What is going on, man? <laughs> I never heard of this place. Dude, are these fish? We're in a pool in a museum playing with animated fish. This is the most unique thing you could ever do on a vacation. Wait, it's a the pool? fish are surrounding us. Look. How did they know to surround us? They love us. They're going everywhere now. Now you're all probably hungry. Something out of like a Disney movie intro. All right, I'll fix it. I'll fix it. Hungry? Which is why we're at this restaurant that is ran by robots. What? Wait. Whoa. Guys, hopefully this happens to, with the USA as well. So I don't know. We're gonna have more, more denizens working, not not having to work these kind of jobs. My name is Pepper. Can we have a seat, Pepper? Sure. <laughs> Let's find a comfortable spot. We reserved the entire place, so the only other people here were the robot waiters. Food robots here. Wait, so the food is delivered on a robot? An oddly fluffy robot. Hey, we we got that in the USA. But I'd be seeing them like malfunction in the USA, guys. Pepper's staring really hard at Chandler He's for some reason. Pepper does not like Chandler. Bro, I did Pepper's nothing to you. <laughs> Everyone, make sure you eat tons of food because tomorrow I rented an entire theme park. They probably gotta like charge them up every night. And PewDiePie's gonna be there. Which is what? Really crazy. You see, PewDiePie and I have a long history. Mr. Beast. I was wondering when you would show up. <laughs> <laughs> we helped him in his subscriber race against T Series. Grab your phone, go on YouTube, search PewDiePie, and subscribe to him. Eventually, we even caught up to him. Mr. Beast has. Guys, Mr. Beast like started his channel when. Um, PewDiePie. It was like, it had like 60 mil subs or something, bro. It's taking over me and subscriber. Dang, bro. The, he has been dethroned. I guess I'm getting it a taste of my own medicine. That's all right. He definitely deserves it. And even though we've been friends for a while, we've never actually met in person. And because this is such a long way to meet up. I rented this entire amusement park. This is Fuji Q Highland, the park with the scariest rides in all of Japan. It usually has thousands of people waiting in line. But as per usual, I rented the entire thing just for us. You can ride whatever ride you want. I wasn't done, but he left. I'm about to go on <laughs> this entire roller coaster. I bet the staff are so happy, so happy that this happened, bro. They're like, yo, we don't have to do, we get a full paycheck. We don't got to deal with nothing, nothing, just like one or two. Sure alone. What you're seeing here is the steepest roller coaster drop in. They just got to chill all day, man. It's like a day off for them. In the world. Are you scared? Yes. Dude. Have fun. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, heck no. <laughs> oh, snap. That'd be wild. That would be awesome, yo. Yeah. And like promised, Th those rides are awesome where they go upside down. The father of YouTube, PewDiePie, <laughs> in the park. A little later than planned because I texted him the wrong day. Sorry, Felix. And he wanted to ride the craziest coaster at the park. Why are you scared? I'm so scared of roller this coasters. One this one doesn't spin at all. I'll ride it at Felix Rides. Yo, yeah. I'm sure Mr. Beast looked up to him, but now PewDiePie probably looks up to him a little. PewDiePie be doing it. He just, he just grinded it out, became number one, and then, you know, he's like, yo, I'm just gonna chill. So he doesn't really upload that much. Especially because he had a baby, guys. Let's go! I'm terrified. <laughs> I'll do it, I'll do it. If I die on this roller coaster, you guys are gonna feel terrible. You take your shoes off? Anything that could fly out. That's how you know it's a bad. They don't even trust us with shoes on this ride. You got this. You'll be fine. I did not. This was my worst nightmare. I'm scared, I'm scared. I don't wanna do this. Come on, Mr. Beast, you're the number one YouTuber. You can't be scared. You're scaring me. Come down. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. 
<laughs> Whatever you do, don't throw up. I'm terrified. Can we pick a better one? We could have picked a nice, comfortable ride. I actually have no idea what it is. At some point, there's a... I wonder what they said off camera. I mean, and that's like private between them, but I don't know. That'd be cool to see what they said. Literal 90 degree drop. <laughs> You're freaking me out. <laughs> what did you sign me up for? You brought me here. Well, what we didn't What's know it? was... Quick, no! This ride goes backwards. Why are we going backwards? <laughs> Oh, oh snap, bro. That's too much. I wonder what his next video is gonna be, you guys. This video only took like two weeks to film or something. Oh my gosh. This is crazy! That is scary. That is scary. Oh my gosh. Felix, what did we just do? I'm crying. Best roller coaster ever. The tears is running down. He's like, yes, I finally, I don't gotta work a day of my life ever again. Well, it's good meeting you, Jamie. I'm gonna head out. <gasps> yeah. We scream at the first little bump. <laughs> what? Thank you. I don't think I've ever <laughs> had a chewy but Yeah, they, uh, I've seen those a lot uh, on TikTok, guys. Potato before. <laughs> It's a cool potato. That's what you get for passing me! <laughs> uh, Felix, I'm sorry for passing you. You don't have to threaten me with violence, though. So. I'm good. Yeah, they are good. That was the $250,000. Man, I'd be making it uncomfortable there. Vacation. Felix, can you transition us? Bro face. <laughs> ah, 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 ah. Alright, guys. Sub subscribe so we can pass T-Series. Yeah, he's trying, man. He's trying. Jimmy never disappoints. Seeing Jimmy and Felix put that smile on your face. This level of commitment this man puts in to try to entertain us is insane. That's the entire team for these amazing videos together. Alright guys, check out Mr. Beast if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys next one.